Welcome, Aries, to Petrella's Intuitive Insights. This is a brief overview of October 1st to the 15th of 2021. As I was getting into the Aries energy, right away I felt like the uh, throat chakra, uh, the mouth, watch the words. Uh, it's time for the Aries to be verbally responsible. So say what you mean, mean what you say. Um, I feel that many of you, when it comes to relationships, especially, uh, uh, you know, familiar, um, your lover, I, you know, be careful. You don't get too lost in fantasy. You may be bringing your awareness too far into the future or too far into the past, remembering what was and, um, or, you know, you need to live in the now, stay in the now Aries. It's important to stay in the now. There's healing that need to stay in the now when it comes to family. I feel that there's family quarreling. And if there hasn't been active quarreling, there's disassociation. And I do feel that there needs to be a healing there, Aries, because our biographies become a part of our biologies. And I get it. Not all of us could interact with our families. I get that actually for the better of many of us, we need to disengage with unhealthy people. So please, I ask you to offer this up in prayer because I feel for some of you Aries, there needs to be a recon reconciliation or some kind of uh, peace that's made and it does involve a mother. So whether this is a divine mother uh, or the mother of your religion or culture, um, or it could be your earthly mother, your stepmother. It could be that you're the mother and you're seeing this quarreling with your children. However, the giving and receiving and the boundaries need to be made very, very clear. So situations like this does not happen in the future. Okay, Aries, I feel that words were spoken, things were said, and this is where the Aries needs to be verbally responsible. I feel when it comes to work, you're strategizing, you're formulating. So you're here, here, taking steps. And I feel that this is something that you've done before. So you have the wisdom, you have the clarity. I feel that there's money backing you up, Aries. There's a healing taking place also with the uh, finance. So whether you're playing catch up or you're paying some sort of restitution of some sort, I feel that that's also coming to a close. So you're getting that debt paid off. What do the Aries need to know as they're listening to this video pertaining to love, romance, relationship? I want to make this clear about your boundaries. Uh, the Aries with being verbally irresponsible. I feel that you've crossed boundaries and have offended. So you need to maybe uh, think about it, go back, maybe offer other words. The giving and the receiving needs to be very equal during this particular time. And look, maybe Aries, your boundaries were crossed verbally by an irresponsible person. That's where you need to absolutely clear and strengthen your boundaries. Aries, love, romance, relationship. October 1st to the 15th of 2021. You're moving forward with something. I actually hear some of you are getting news. It could be about a former lover, a former relationship. It could be a relative or somebody from the past you haven't seen or heard about and you're hearing that um, they're not doing so well. I feel that it could be, again, a person's biography becomes your biology. And um, <clears throat> that doesn't mean to say that children aren't born sick, etc. But you're gonna see oftentimes an illness, uh, how it affects a person. Ooh. Yeah, something's gonna be changing, coming to an end here. And I do feel it's with that um, phone call or you're gonna be hearing about that. 
Uh, now look, let's just shake off that energy because there's this energy of success for the Aries and it's moving forward. So I don't know if you're planning on moving, buying a new home, buying a second home. Um, something's going on with property and then Aries. And in fact, I'm gonna go, if some of you are not in that situation, I feel that you're reclaiming property. Uh, it could be clearing up, sorting out properties. Aries, love romance, relationship. Aries, isn't that funny? Love romance, relationship. Now look, I'm in love romance, relationship mode here and it seems as if things have been status quo for a while. Well, they're gonna, when they start changing, they will start changing quickly. There's a piece of information that you're unaware of. This could be about a previous lover or the person you're with now or somebody that you're wanting to be with. And it has to do with money. It has to do with money. Look at that. So there's a mystery with uh, a relationship and it does have to do with money. Here's the happy family life. Ultimately, during this particular time, I feel that it's going to be a happy family, uh, generally a real good time for you. Let's go on to career finance. Career finance, Aries, October 1st to the 15th, 2021. What do the Aries need to know as they're listening to this video pertaining to career and finance? Okay, a couple things fell out. Ooh, interesting. Interesting. Okay, this is the first card to flip. It is, you're gonna have friends helping you. Friends help you with career, finance. So whether this is you, the Aries moving forward in a career, or you're helping somebody else, they're helping you. It's gonna be a win-win situation there. Um, now, I do feel that you need to play nicely with others. So in this setting, there may be one or two people who you're not really sure about, and maybe they're not really sure about you yet, Aries. And last but least, here's that snake card. And look, it flew out with a sun card. And so when I'm looking at this, I'm saying, oh, Aries, you're gonna see it. You're gonna know it. You're gonna see the snake. You're gonna hear the snake. A snake is a snake. I know in the comments, and please do leave the comments, I hope they're positive. You're gonna say the snake is a sign of transformation. I get that. A shedding of the skin, I get that. But because I'm not really a card reader, <clears throat> I'm actually a psychic medium. And when I see the snake and the sun shining on the snake, that means that the Aries is gonna come um, and to what he needs or she needs to see will be revealed to you. You will see what you need to see. <laughs> so praise be, right? <laughs> Career finance. Oh yeah, you're gonna be recognized for your work. Definitely. Look, Aries, you need to pay attention to your health during this time. I feel that many of you have been burning the candle at both, both ends. So just, you know, take time. Remember, one day a week, take it off. Just take it off to rest. Um, proper food, nutrition. Uh, God designed us to be hunters and gatherers. So be sure to walk outdoors if you can, 10 to 15 minutes every day. Is there any other messages that the Aries may need to know? as they're listening to this video, October 1st to the 15th of 2021. Strong feminine energy. I just heard pay attention to the moon. <laughs> so, you know, Aries, with that, if this resonated with you, please click like, share, and subscribe. Private readings, patrolisintuitiveinsights.com. It's listed in the link below. And with that, God bless you.